Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So hot off the press, I have just had this delivered. So I thought I'd do a quick unboxing and bagging video for you. It's a new to me company. It's Diamond Art Studio .co .uk. So it's UK based company and it's a sampler pack that I've ordered. So let's have a look and see what's inside. Okay, this looks exciting. Um, oops, let's get this out there. There you are. Oh, look at this. These look absolutely wonderful. Okay, nice purple bag. One of my favourite colours. Oh, and look at these. Diamondartstudio.co.uk And they've even got it on the ribbons. Look at that. Oh, that's fantastic. So, I ordered two of the diamond paint. Uh, okay, so let's have a look at the first one. Right, this was like um, when, I think it's Dreamer Designs and Diamond Art Club in the US were doing special offers of canvases for like £8 um, as like a sample. We couldn't have them in the UK. They didn't ship to the UK. So that was quite disappointing for us. So these are like little ones. Um, I will put the price down below. I think they're around about £7, but I will put the price down below. Um, and I'll sort the postage out as well. And I just thought, yeah, that's really good. We're getting a special offer in the UK now as well. So let's take these ribbons off. Look at that. Let's have a look at this one first. Thank you for your purchase. Whoops. And that's from diamondartstudio.co.uk. And that's their website there. And, oh, look. And a sticker on the back as well. So that's wonderful. Oh, I love how these package. Going great so far. So that's that one there. Okay. Uh, oops, it's got a little bit squished. Okay. We pride ourselves on offering the highest quality diamond painting kits available straight from our UK warehouse. Stay updated with our lo lo latest offers and designs. Diamondartstudio.co.uk. So there you are. That's lovely. Oh, I do like nice packaging. It makes it like Christmas. So this is all brown paper. So this is all going to go in the recycle bin as well, which is brilliant. Okay, let's get this open and let's have a look. Oh, wow. Look at the box as well. We've got our own boxes. Just put the packaging out of the way. There we are, we've got sample look, 15 by 15, so, you know, it's only a little snack size, a little smaller one, uh, included in the package. So we've got high definition painting canvas, stone diamond tray, drill pen and painting mud. And that's the back of the box there, look. And it tells you, unroll the canvas and tape it down onto a flat surface so it's telling you all your instructions for diamond painting there and um, that's your little kit there nicely packaged box look at that with the diamonds and the butterflies i'll be keeping these boxes these are fab oh, i'm so impressed with this it's so nice to see when new companies start getting things right so let's see if we can get the canvas and the drills and everything else right okay so we've got a sample there that looks like a good tool kit and let's get the little canvas out and it is a little one it is just a snack size okay so it's 15 by 15 it says and it's poured glue which is brilliant so let's just give it a little help and give it a little roll the other way just to help it to stay flat a little bit Okay, and we'll just lift up this bit. This is lovely. This is going to be an hour or two hours work, probably. But just something nice, and the colours are beautiful. Really, really good. Let's just get you flat. There you are. Okay, and it is so clear. So, look at that Diamond Art Studio logo at the top. We've got a great little key code down the side there and we've got some good symbols they all look quite clear there little picture there little thumbnail tells us what it is there we've also got a key code on the other side as well so the spoiling us 
and then we've got all their Facebook and Instagram and their website and this is the platinum collection so look at that just do that so you can see those if you're wanting to join the Facebook group or follow them on Instagram that's brilliant so I really do like this and this canvas is lovely it's quite rough on the back I think you can hear that they've done a scalloped edge to stop it fraying which is good when it's this size as well um, I always think it's such a shame though when they go to the trouble of doing a scalloped edge and then you end up cutting it off. But to be honest with this, I may put something around the edging. Maybe put some card or do a frame around the edge and actually keep that. But these would make um, super greetings cards as well. That will go on an 8 by 8 size greetings card. Let me just get a card blank and just have a look. Got one somewhere. Okay. Well, this is an 8 by 8 card envelope, so yeah, it's going to fit lovely onto an 8 by 8 card with some matting and layer in there. So you can make these into cards, but these are just super. And it's nice to just have a little try, when you, particularly when you get a new company, because you're not sure what you're getting and there are so many companies out there you know you you work hard for your money you want to be spending it on something that's really good let's just have a look at the drill field okay i'll just take the cover off there and you can see there focusing camera see how close we can get look how clear those symbols are and we've got white on the darker colors and then we've also got black there as well but yeah that's great and you can tell it's sticky because it's holding on to the cover sheet there so i'm really impressed with that that's lovely let's have a look at our little toolkit then there seems to be an awful lot in here for a smaller kit let's get uh, this little bag open Oops. okay so let's see what we've got oh come on out that's it Okay, so we've got your standard um, pen there with your single placer and we've also got, let me have a look at my chart because I'm no good at placers. So I think that one is, oops, sorry, I will get used to holding these the right way. That one is a four placer and that one looks like, is it six or is it seven? Oh, that one's a seven placer. So that's a spare one that I haven't got. <laughs> so that may or may not go onto my chart. So we've got a four placer and a seven placer in there for people who like multi-placing. So that's brilliant. You've got your lovely little boat there, which is that a moss for boat? No, it doesn't say so. But that's your little boat with your spout. These are good for using small amounts of diamonds. I do love my big trays when you've got a larger amount. But if you've only got a small amount of diamonds, then the small trays are just as good. And it's got quite a good height on the side there. We've got a little um, pen grip or squishy, as people call them. Which Oh, that's a good tight fit as well. So that's not going anywhere. So if you do like using these pens, uh, you've just got that bit of extra there. And then you've got a little pot of the blue wax. Now, I've not tried the blue wax, so that will be interesting to try. And that's a good thickness there, if you can see that. Yep, yeah, that's going to focus in there. That's a good thickness, and I do like the little pots. Okay, so that keeping the lid on, I'll just keep it a bit moist. And then you've got your fantastic good tweezers. These are the really pointy tweezers, so do be careful with them, because they are really, really sharp. Um, that's why they come with your little cover so that you can keep them covered up when you've got them in a box. You don't want to be stabbing yourself with those. But yeah, that's brilliant. So that's a fantastic little toolkit. Better than your basic toolkit. That's not just a starter toolkit. That's a good upgraded one there. So let's have a look at these drills and see what we get with these. And I will get these done uh, for you within the next week or so. And I'll do a completion video. Uh, now then... This hasn't actually got on it. Oh, yeah, it does say there. It says sample R 
a 15 by 15 R and it does say sample R there. So it has got the number on it. I did think then, oh dear, we haven't got the number on this. I do bag them all up in little separate bags. So I do have like an organisation. But that is a lot of colours for a little painting. That just shows the quality as well. Because 14 colours on a little... Let's just measure. Let's see what size we are. See if it's the canvas size or if it's the drill size. That's 15 by 15. Let's have a look. So the canvas size is 15. That way. And it looks like it is 15 that way. So the canvas, the drill area is exactly as it says. 15 by 15. That's fantastic. Okay, let's have a look at the quality of these drills then. So the darker colours tend to be used more, so they tend to be the ones that, uh, if you're um, going to get problems with drills, it does tend to be the darker colours because they produce more, so you, you, law of averages, you get more problems with them. But they look good and clear. I cannot see any trash in there whatsoever, and the shine on these is lovely. Look at that one. So there's no DM number or are they dmc numbers they they are the dmc numbers so i apologize so we've got dmc numbers as well wow this this is just wonderful oh i'll definitely be getting a bigger kit so i'm going to work this one up and then we will get a bigger kit on this so we've got all your greens 501 502 503 505 and then like a, a musty color 781 Back to greens, 890, 924. A nice stony colour there, 3024. A blue colour, which is 3750, which is down here at the bottom. And just little bits at the top. Back to green again, 3817. Oh, look at that yellow, lovely sunshine yellow. We could do with a bit of bright sunshine today. That's 3821. 3852 is back to like a mustardy, deeper yellow. And 3865 and 3866. So they make up your daisy. But this is just wonderful. I'm so pleased with this. So let me put this one on one side. And I'll be back in a second with the next one. Okay, and we're back with the second one. So let's have a look at this. Oh, these ribbons. I love ribbons. Purple ribbons. And again, you've got your sticker on the back with their logo on. The branding on this is wonderful. Really really good okay your nice little thank you card there and let's get into this one again i do like the brown paper packaging top marks for that okay. let's get into this one so they have got a little bit squidged but that's just to be expected when they're coming through the purse i think you can see that one Please do not tell Millie, my Scotty, that I have a cat. She's been chasing cats again in the garden, so she'd be cross if she knows I'm doing a cat. Okay, so this one is 13 by 17. Again, we've got your little thumbnail there on your box, so you know what it is. Tells you what we've got. Instructions on the back. And oh, I love this box. Look at that, purple butterflies and blossom. And all your diamonds at the front. That's great. So let's get into it and have a look and see if it's as good as the first one. I'm sure it will be. Okay, so let's uh, looks like we've got the same toolkit. Just double check everything's the same in this one. Top marks as well for the toolkit because this you know for a present for somebody or somebody that's just starting out. Or even just to top up your own supplies. This is superb. I love these tweezers. These are my favourite tweezers. Very sharp. But uh, they work really well. Really good with drills. Uh, you've got your little pen uh, squishy. Your uh, pen holder there. Just to go. I always put these straight on so I don't lose them. Your little pot of wax. And yep. I think that's a... Oh, is that a seven place of the same? Yep. So we've got a seven placer again and a three placer and these are the thin ones which are the good quality ones as well which i understand are easier to use i'm not brilliant at multi-placing it's something that i'm trying and i will get there eventually because i do want to multi-place 
um, but at the moment I just single place everything and your little tray so that's your tool kit it's the same as the first one that is wonderful okay and oh let's have a look at the canvas next just give it a little squidge around the other way oh these are so sweet those okay, these canvases I love them really good quality oh and look at that little face let me just uh, peel up that's it. please do not tell my Scotty dog Millie that I'm doing a CAT because she will go mad Okay. Just get that flattened down a bit, just helps it to sit flatter. Again, we've got the lovely scalloped edge, and you've got your schematic, your little key code on both sides. You've got your little uh, cat there, your little thumbnail of your cat. You've got all the details at the bottom of where diamondartstudio.co.uk are, so that's wonderful. Let's just check that the drills. This is sample 13 by 17 S. Yep, so that's there as well. Sorry, you saw my head there. That's not very good, is it? So, yep, we've got sample 13 by 17 there. But look at that. Those eyes. Ooh. And that little face, it does look like it's smiling. Don't you just want to get those little cheeks? Oh. I do love animals. I used to have three cats, but unfortunately uh, my hubby is allergic to them so I can't have one now and Millie our Scotty isn't keen anyway so let's do a quick uh, measure on this one and see if we are 13 by 17 okay so width wise yep exactly 17 and depth there is 15 yep exactly 15 13 and Flies there is 13 sorry i can't even see look i'm looking at the inches yep 13 so it's exactly as it says the drill field is the size that it says on the canvas look at that so let's have a closer look at these uh, the drill field and then let's see if we can just get that in there yep so we've got lighter colored numbers on dark areas um and we've got some white. Some of those A's at this side here are a little bit difficult to see for me, but I do use a light pad on a darker colour. Um, oh, I don't think actually they're possibly the stars. Yeah, they are. Sorry, it's my eyesight, not the canvas. <laughs> okay, uh, but yeah, they look lovely. And that is super sticky because it's sticking down to the cover paper brilliantly. Oh, these are so cute. I love that little face, the little cheeks. Oh, it's great. Okay, so let's have a look at the drills. Go. So again, we have, oh, we have 11 colours on this one. So not as many as the actual, as the daisy, but we've still got plenty in there for shading. And there's one, two, three four five about six colors in those eyes that's really going to make those pop that's good charting when you get a lot of colors for your shading and your depth there okay so let's have a look at these colors again they've got dmc codes on oh and this one is a square so we're giving the squares a try on this one okay so we've got a round one and a square one to try okay so all right, that's the uh, 310 in black, and they are notoriously bad drills, um, 310s, again, because of the quantity and the law of averages, but there is not one bit of scrap, and I, I can see that they're all square. I can't see any knobbly bits on any of those. Those drills look superb. Okay, so we've got 310, 317, 318. These are all your greys for your kitty cat. 413, 414, there's four grey colours there are going to look great. They're really going to give depth to this cap for its fair. And then we've got 453, which I think is your background. And then just some browns for the shading, 938, 975. And these will be in the eyes as well. Yeah, that one's the eyes. Lovely, that like ambery brown colour. 
976, 3371 and 3799. Wow. Oh, I'm so impressed with these. I will definitely be ordering from this company. I will put all of the links to these down below for you. Let me just get the little daisy as well. So there you are. Get it right way up. That's your two canvases that I've got. As I say, they were just tester ones and it was nice to see that these were available to us in the UK because there have been tester ones from other companies and we've not been able to partake. But this is brilliant and I love that cat. I mean, I, I like flowers, but I'm and I'm, a, I'm an animal lover. Um, when you see which canvases I do, you will realise that I do tend to sway towards animals. So, yeah. That's uh, me done for this unboxing. I will come back to you once I've got these canvases all um, done. But yeah, so thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, please subscribe down in the bottom there and you'll be notified of when the next videos are posted and you'll get to see when I've completed these. Thanks for watching. See you all again soon.